so happy to see you. I'm Shamaptin. So good to have you here. And today I have 10 gel moisturizers for summer. These are lightweight, really hydrating. This also nourish your skin without feeling heavy or sticky. And if you're someone you don't like too much creamy moisturizers, you want something more hydrating, something lightweight, you may find these things to be helpful. So let's start. First I have, okay, so you know I have been loving this one from Simple, their vitamin C moisturizing gel, glow gel and I love it. This is awesome but I also have been trying their water boost range and these are good too. So this is available on my Hype store but these are not. These are only available on Mintra and you told me about it. Thank you so much and I love these things. These are affordable, this work. So one is sleeping cream, another is gel cream. And this gel cream is slightly more thick than this one. So if you don't find this to be enough nourishing, try this one. This is obviously more hydrating, more nourishing. But if you want something lightweight, like more lightweight, then go for um, this one, this vitamin C moisturizer. But know this, both of these are lightweight, but this is more lightweight. And yeah, this is really good. The packaging is really convenient. It contains very basic ingredients like humectants to hydrate your skin, occlusives to prevent the water loss. It also has sodium PCA, which is there to soothe your skin. It also has pentaven, which is quite hydrating and can support your skin barrier. This is fragrance free. Overall, a very good no-nonsense gel moisturizer. And also I have this one from the same range. This is the Skin Quench Slipping Cream and it is almost like that Innisfree Aloe Slipping Mask. Uh, but it has, according to me, it has better texture and it is lighter yet it is nourishing and yeah if you don't want thick night creams you can try this ingredients are very much same like this one this one is the second ingredient of this moisturizer where dametico is the second ingredient of this moisturizer so it is very good at preventing the trans epidermal water loss because the occlusive is gonna lock the hydration it also has hydrating ingredients then vitamin e sodium pca and if you have dehydrated skin, it's gonna help you a lot. It's gonna help you a lot, but if your skin doesn't like silicones, then these are not it because these are heavily silicone based. But silicone works beautifully on my skin and I have been loving this range. Affordable, no nonsense, can be really good for summer. Even the vitamin C range is quite nice. And yeah, right now they only have these things on Mentra and they're saying it is for dry and sensitive skin. But I do think it can work for all skin types because the texture is not that thick and yeah this is beautiful next we have these two gel creams and you're gonna love this if your skin likes centella if you want something soothing this contain good amount of centella these have ceramides i like this one more because it works better for my skin it is very good at supporting the skin barrier it also moisturizes my skin well but this one is also quite nice this is serene's plump it louder both of these are really hydrating very beautiful texture and very beautiful formulations these are fragrance free and if you have irritated skin if your skin likes soothing calming ingredients if your skin likes ceramides centella then you're gonna love this too also serene has a gel moisturizer with niacinamide but it has been out of stock for a long time so if you want a gel moisturizer with niacinamide I have this one, this is from Bioderma. It contains glycerin, niacinamide. This is their Atoderm Intensive Gel Cream. Very good gel moisturizer for sensitive skin. Also, if you have dull skin, it's gonna work for you. Very good at hydrating, nourishing. Also, I've noticed when I get redness, it works really well to soothe the skin as well. You get 75 ml of product with this one, and this is lovely. I have bought this last year just during winter and I thought I'm gonna try this 
when the weather is going to be hot and yeah i i love this one i have to tell you one thing when you're going to be applying moisturizers apply these things on damp skin this way these are going to work the best i have really good moisturizers for this video i'm really happy to give you these options because these are really really wonderful and i think for summer these are going to help you a lot so then i have something if you have fungal acne if your skin doesn't like glycerin yeah there are many people who are allergic to glycerin as well and this is very normal even there are people who are allergic to water yeah this is true actually you can develop allergy from almost anything and there are some common allergens and there are some uncommon allergens and if you don't like glycerin in your skincare then try that one from formula rx i don't have it right now because i have finished it and yeah this is a very good moisturizer and we don't have much options out there where we don't find glycerin in the formula the formula rx has very good gel moisturizers and my skin likes glycerin to be very honest so i'm happy that glycerin based things are working but if you want something different then you can try that one it has very really lightweight texture and can work well for summer so next i have this popular night gel from dot and key they are sika night gel it has green tea niacinamide and this is quite good but it contains menthol i think it has peppermint oil so if your skin doesn't like peppermint oil at all do not try this even i was like there are times peppermint oil doesn't work for me at all so i was like it may give me <laughs> reaction so i did a patch test then i tried it and thank god it worked for me it didn't give me any irritation but again i'm telling you if your skin doesn't like peppermint oil do not try this it also has color i think because it is um um green in color it has very lighter texture and it absorbs quite well but to be very honest this is my list like favorite formulation from this entire things that i have for this video but sometimes things work well you know even with the ingredients you think they don't work for your skin sometimes they do because of the formulations i think so that's there and yeah i'm really liking it i prefer this packaging over there this top packaging and yeah let me know if you have tried it if it worked for you for me it has been working well and this is nice it also has aloe vera it has sika niacinamide it also has oat oil it also has chlorophyll so the green color is coming from the chlorophyll and there's uh, colors as well and uh, it also has vitamin e it also has ceramides bunch of ceramides which are great and yeah except the peppermint part i love everything about it and thank god it didn't give me any skin reaction but yeah be watchful if your skin doesn't like peppermint at all it's not gonna work for you your patch taste with it and then i have this one from soon jung it was house this is my holy grail you know i buy this every year and i have been using this for how long two or three years something like that this is lightest most hydrating thing ever and very soothing very calming also if you find it too light use this with squalene also you can try this one from doctor says that aloe panthenol hydrating gel this is quite nice too it has glycerin urea niacinamide it has panthenol centella very good stuff but it works better for me the formulation is better for this one but it works better for me i mean it performs better for my skin so that's all i have for now and also i made this video on moisturizers few days back you may find this to be helpful too and let me know about your favorite gel moisturizers i have other things as well but you could stop somewhere because if i give you too many options you're gonna be confused so yeah and i hope you found this to be helpful and let me know if you have any questions in the comments box i will be there and i'm gonna see you very soon then bye bye